One of the things we like to do here on the show is we do a thing called 12 questions. So I'm going to ask you yeah. 12 questions. You go it's rapid fire. You answer how you want. There's no wrong answers. Okay. Ready for this? Yeah. 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 12 questions with Louis Binks. All right, here we go. You ready? Question one. What is your favorite sport? Football. What song or band would you want playing as you walked into a stadium? Drake. Footy sport. What is your favorite footy or sport team? Gillingham. You're supposed to say the club you play for, bro. Uh, yeah. No. It's a joke. So I, I thought it might be a bit different. I like it. Favorite athlete, dead or alive? Uh, Sergio Ramos and John Terry. Nice. I'm a huge Terry fan as well. Favorite yeah. breakfast item? I'm not a big breakfast lover, but uh, salmon, smoked salmon. Living the life, brother. Favorite drink, alcoholic or non alcoholic? Uh, Fanta. Really? Yeah. That's amazing. I'm a Dr. Pepper man, but we'll leave it like that. Uh, <laughs> tea or coffee? Tea. Dream trip. What, in the world? Yep. I, I love going to Dubai. Uh, have you been to Dubai? Yeah, I've been there a few times. But so if you, if you had to go anywhere in the oh, world, that's where you'd go? There, or I've never been to Brazil. I'd love to go to Brazil. Lovely. Favorite condiment? Uh, ketchup. Pajamas or no pajamas? No, nah, no pajamas. Favorite social media account or social account that you're following that you would like to sort of call out or shout out that our listeners could check out? Uh, there's a thing called Rising Ballers in the UK that promote up and coming, which is quite good. And also a account, Soccer Elite. It's a very good training, um, like a sports um, academy back home in England. Soccer Elite and that people can follow and they can learn some tips. Yeah. Uh, superstition. What do you have? Game day, uh, uh, training, that kind of thing. I don't really have any. I've got I've got a pair of shin pads that I, I always wear and I have to I have to wear. Well, dude, that's that's, a super kid. that's that's a thing. That's that's mine then. That's my super So what super happens thing. if those shin pads are gone? There's there's no game, you're not going, you're not suiting up? They actually went missing in Dallas. So I had to buy a new pair, um, which I weren't happy about, but no. They're they're uh, they're personalised. They've got pictures of like family on, and so I literally got a, another copy sent to me. But yeah, they're not the same as the the first one. Do do football? Do a lot of I've seen that. Do a lot of footballers personalise uh, their shin pads? Yeah, I say a few of them. Yeah, because that's really the only piece of equipment you can do that on. It's either that or you put some naming or some initials on your boots, right? Yeah, I've seen I've seen players have personalised wash bags, like they've got their. Um, like family on their wash bags and yeah they take them to games which is quite cool that's cool last question so you call it soccer or football football all day football all day all day football